Hi, I'm Mrs. Shattuck, and this video is to show you a little bit about BMS. We can't be in the building right now, but we can give you a small idea about what to expect in the fall. Hi, welcome to Bluffs Middle School. I'm Jana Mason, the building principal. I'm Jason Blanco, assistant principal, assistant activities director. I'm Bree Rock, assistant principal. This is the BMS counseling office. Each grade level is assigned a guidance counselor. Let's meet our BMS counselors. Hi, welcome to the BMS Counseling Office. I'm Mrs. D, one of the counselors. And I'm Mrs. Davis, one of the counselors. I'm Mrs. Goodwin, one of the counselors. And I'm Hopi, I am the secretary here in the Counseling Office. Welcome. Each student at BMS is assigned to a team in their grade level. These teams consist of four core teachers that you spend the whole year with. All teams are named after a specific cat. Sixth grade are the Pumas or Bearcats. Seventh grade are Bobcats or Arctic Cats and eighth grade are the Panthers or Tigers. Your locker will be with your teammates as well. Every student at BMS is assigned their own locker that has a combination lock. Sixth graders, don't worry. Your teachers will give you time to practice opening your locker when you start at BMS. Your passing time in between classes is always four minutes. Use that time wisely. If you are tardy for class, you will have to serve detention with the teacher after school. Exploratory classes are classes that students sometimes get to choose and are different from core classes like math or social studies. Some of BMS's exploratory classes include computer science, web page design, money and you, intro to marketing, healthy living, Asian cultures, career exploration, choir, band, cooking for teens, art, and much more. All BMS students take PE. Sixth graders have PE all year. Seventh and eighth grade students take PE for one semester. PE classes are taught by Mrs. Talkington, Mr. Berta, and Mr. Stadola. Here's Mrs. Talkington to explain how PE works at BMS. Hi, my name is Brooks Talkington. I teach PE at Bluffs Middle School. Um, I have all the seventh and eighth grade girls. Uh, Mr. Berta has all of the 7th and 8th grade boys, and Mr. Stadola teaches all of the 6th graders. Uh, at BMS PE, the 6th graders have PE all year long, every day, and they are required to just make sure they have tennis shoes on a daily basis. They do not dress out for PE. Now, the 7th and 8th graders have PE for one semester each year, and they do dress out in the locker rooms. And so they're required to bring, make sure they have tennis shoes every day, a t-shirt and a pair of shorts that they change into. Uh, we have our syllabus online on our web pages on the um, school website. And so any questions that you have are probably gonna be able to be answered just by looking at that syllabus. Um, we're happy to answer any questions. Our emails are on there and happy to have you here at BMS. Buses always drop off students on the west side of BMS. This is the same spot buses will pick students up at the end of the day. Each grade level at BMS has a designated spot to wait each day when students arrive. The expectation is that you wait on the sidewalk and stay off the grass. You will stay in your designated area until staff give you the okay to enter the building. Once winter hits, BMS students wait inside. During the winter months, BMS students can enter their grade level designated doors when they arrive at school and sit by their lockers until the bell rings. Each grade level eats lunch during a different period of the day. During that time, students eat lunch for half of the period and spend the other half of the period in homeroom. When students arrive in the cafeteria, they are allowed to place a book or a pencil bag on the seat they would like to sit in to save their seat while they get their food. Chromebooks are placed in the middle of the table. Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays, girls get to go through the lunch line first. Tuesdays and Thursdays, boys go first. When you are finished eating, dump your tray and return to your seat until the supervision staff instructs you to meet your homeroom teacher or the bell rings to go to the next period. Homeroom is a time to get your homework done, read, learn digital citizenship, and visit the BMS library. If you have lunch A, you will meet your homeroom teacher in the cafeteria. Lunch B students go to homeroom first, then teachers will escort students to the cafeteria. 
Sometimes you need to visit the nurse. Nurse Wheeler will explain how nursing practices work at BMS. Hello, my name is Nurse Wheeler. Um, I work at the middle school. Um, there's a few things we want to address to keep your students safe and have them be successful. Number one are medications. All medications need to be kept in the health office. All prescription medications require doctor's orders that match the prescription label. Um, over the counter medications, parents can sign in a permission form for this and need to provide the medication in a bottle less than 24 tablets. For um, any asthma or anaphylactic plans, these need to be renewed every school year. Students can self carry their inhalers, and we do encourage that here at the middle school. Um, I do recommend EpiPids be kept here in the health office. For any other health condition um, that might affect your student's school day, including diabetes, seizures, and dietary plans, please let me know as there's some paperwork that we need for those. Um, for all seventh graders, uh, make sure you get your school, seventh grade school physical before the beginning of the school year and our current and all year organizations. This is the BMS Media Center. All BMS students are able to access the Media Center during their designated homeroom times to check out books and use other elements of the Media Center. All students at Bluffs Middle School are issued a Chromebook to use for school purposes. BMS students are personally responsible for their Chromebooks. If you need help with your Chromebook, you can visit Mrs. Shattuck and Mrs. Collins in the BMS Media Center. You will learn more about Chromebook expectations in the fall.